ایکاؤنٹیبلٹی There is going to be an accountability of the ummas, of the communities. And first of all, the messenger who was sent to that ummah, he will stand up and he will testify before Lord, O oh Allah, your message which came to me through Jibreel, I had conveyed to them. Now they are responsible. So this is, you know, a... a A witnessing of the messengers of Allah against their people because now they have no excuse they can't plead ignorance they can't say oh Allah your message was not conveyed to us they will testify and then after that these people who disbelieve who have rejected the idea rejected the faith and iman then they will not be allowed nor they will be given a chance to apologize no apologies time has gone no repenting over here useful and when these evil doers will see the chastisement before their before their own eyes then this chastisement will not be neither lightened for them nor it will be they will be respited is very interesting scene now. When these people who were associating others with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, who were committing shirk with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, they will see those whom they thought that they are the partners with Allah. Maybe somebody, he spots, there, there, there is Shaykh Abdul Qadir Jilani. Or there is the saint, you know, for whom we had carved an idol. All the idols of Hazrat, the people of Hazrat Nuh were carved as representing the, the saints who had died. Or Ya Allah, they were the saints. They were good people. But after they died, they made, you know, the idols in their names. So now they see, there is the person or that is the angel which I used to worship. When these people, Mushrikeen, these people who were declared somebody, declaring somebody to be partner with Allah, when they will see their partners, they will cry out, Oh Allah, they are the Shuraka, they are the partners whom we, we, we were worshipping along with you. But those saints or angels will retort back saying, you are lying. We don't know that you were worshipping us. You are liars. And that day, they will offer all their submission to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And whatever they had fabricated, that will go away from them. They have to be lost. Alladheena kafaru wa saddu an sabirillah zidna hum azab an fawqa ladabi bima kanu yusadun. Now there is another category. One is a kafir himself. And the other one, not only that he is kafir himself, he is calling other people also to commit kufr. Just as if a Muslim is a good man, he is going good deeds, well this is one level. But a person who is not only doing good deeds himself, he is Yamur bil Maruf Anil Munkar, exhorting people to do good deeds and forbidding them from bad. So he is at a higher level. So in the same way, at a higher level will be the kuffar. Allazina kafaru wa saddu an sabirillah. Those who committed kufr themselves, they rejected the faith and the call of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And they barred others also from accepting the faith and call of Muhammad. 
to such people we shall go on increasing chastisement over chastisement or more increasing chastisement because they were spreading corruption and they were making people calling people towards the wrong way again the same thing recall the day when we shall raise from every community a witness from among them who will testify against them min anfusihim wa jaina bika shahidan ala haulai and we shall bring forth you o muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam to testify against these people your nation who were quraish nation of muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam his kitan kin this is your nation this is your tribe but on the day of judgment you will have to stand and testify before the lord that oh allah i had conveyed to them your message now they are responsible they can't plead ignorance wa yawma nabasu fi kulli ummatin shahidan alayhim min anfusihim wa jaina bika shahidan ala haulai wa nazzalna alaykal kitaba tibyanan li kulli shay and we have sent down this book on you o muhammad sallallahu alayhi wasallam which explains everything wa hudan and is a guidance wa rahmatan and a mercy wa bushra lil muslimin and it is a glad tidings for those who submit themselves to the will of allah allahumma rabbana ij'alna minhum may allah include us among them